Yeah, on this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to remove Google verification on your techno phone. First, you need to connect to a Wi Fi network. And after connecting to a Wi Fi network, you will need to insert SIM card in your phone. After it has connected to a Wi Fi network, I'm going to show you that I have Google verification on the phone, so I cannot bypass it and get it to the home menu. As you can see, there's no way that I can even access the phone. So, first, you click on the emergency on the emergency type on the emergency info twice and click on the pencil icon agree contact add contact then choose any contact on your sim after choosing the contact click on the contact you just use it and allow permission just allow any permission then click on the three dot of the and click share choose sender allow permission allow permission on the phone And this you need two phones to do this first you download an APK file called quick shortcut maker and Google settings I'll provide the links in the description please do not skip any part of this video After connecting the sender to the other phone, transfer the apps you downloaded on the other phone to your techno phone. So here, as you can see, I will just send Google Play, Google Play settings, and Quick Shortcut Maker. After sending, after sending the files, install all the apps. The Google Account Manager will not work, but I just leave it like that. You see, upgrade, cancel it. Settings. When you go to settings, click on unknown source to enable it click on device administrator find my phone De deactivate it after deactivating go back and install all your apps you downloaded first you install google settings the app have installed after installing all the apps all you have to do is to go to settings and friends remember to subscribe to my channel the name is guru boy and I said Google account manager will not work so you just get that part and proceed install the 
quick shortcut maker again click on it the icon and install it after installing it open quick shortcut maker open it when you open the app search for launcher 3 here I'm going to type it launcher 3 L A U N C H and you can see it does it then you choose the second one then click on try got it then it will bring you to the home menu then go to settings when you get to settings scroll to apps locate your apps go to google play service Go to, go to Google Play Service on all apps. Google Play Service. Go to storage and memory. Clear the cache. Manage space. Clear data. And now, disable Google Play Service. After disabling Google Play Service, go back. Go back to the home screen. On the home screen, click location, yes, security, then you go back. That's it. Then you go back to the ho your home menu. Then you click Google Play. <laughs> so here you sign in with your Google account. And press use your Google account. Do you not use any ones? Google account because if you use someone Google account and whenever you restart your phone you are going to face the same problem so always use your own Google account so here I'm going to type my gmail account that's it kweku jima 151 you can see and next and the password I'm going to pause it then I will input my password yeah then press next it will say Google play has stop after signing it will say Google Play has stopped. Then it will say open again. Type on open again. Yeah, here is it. Google Play has stopped. Open again then. You see authentication required. Authentication is being required. So you need to go back to settings and scroll to apps. And we go back to Google Play service again. Google Play service again. Then we enable it. After enable it, let's go to Play Store again to check if the authentication will just go away. Wait a while. 
after going into the app go back as you can see my account is already there so here click back then enter the app again and everything will be okay and now you can see your play store is working so now all we are going to do is to just restart the phone so power off the phone then boot it back again you can even use restart button for the phone to auto reboot itself after restarting I'm going to show you how to just bypass it easily from here it shouldn't even take you one minute or so so now we are in the phone click on get started set up new device and it will connect to network server since we have already connected to wi-fi network it will check for update wait patiently and you can see account already added kokujima at gmail.com yeah that's it press next just a second you wait do not skip any part of this video if you skip any part of this video you're gonna miss many many things so be patient and follow the procedure to set your phone we are almost done after bypassing this it will require you to enter your pin yeah you will just say not now if you wish to input a pin you can choose it for by, for now i will say not now and it will check for system update also now you click next then click no thanks set up later then choose your country here i'm going to choose ghana you can choose any country and now you can see we are in the phone where everything is working perfectly on our droid type 7d very easily very easily let's go to settings about the device and you can see it's over there techno droid tab 7d yeah that's it and please friends remember to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell button to get updated thanks for watching my video and please share to friends thank you for watching